paparazzi. No paparazzi, leave me and my family alone. Dude, oh damn, okay. I dropped some. Gonna retell the story? This is after hours. Mm. Yeah. Ah. This is real creep. Mm. Or you can tell the story and eat oil at the same time. No. I can't. I'm. I'm not telling the story well. But no, great. No, you're always it's disappointed. Better. You're always disappointed. It's getting better every time. Come on, go for it. No. The crowd is asking. No. <laughs> <laughs> the fans are tweeting. Yeah. Oh, oh. She and her husband. Are you done? Oh yeah, thank you. Sorry, I've been too Thank you. Um. Yeah, she, she, you had to do very wild costumes and people put on a lot of effort, like yeah. crazy effort. Like they would sometimes do like a building or something or like and get people to help them carry the yeah. bottom. And then while you're voguing, like the people in the audience are like, hey, that sucks! Or like, oh yeah, you look great! And there's like different houses and stuff okay. and the person yeah. has to just hold themselves and be like, yeah. yeah like, um, but unfortunately I never saw her do it. But anyway, oh thank you. On her last voguing Vogue ball, when she was in Berlin, she decided to make a hat out of live lilies and her husband Pierre helped her do it. Yeah. So they bought the lilies and they were still like that, but by the evening yeah. they were like, they were like this. Yeah. And she was telling me like, oh my god, like she has a very specific way of talking I guess, mm. and she was like, oh my god, like you should have seen, she's Australian, she was like, you should have seen like on the train, like there were all these German women, they hadn't smiled for like 30 years and then they were, they were like smiling at me because of my lily hat and she was like imitating them, calling their friends like Oh Barbara, weißt du was ich, was, weißt du was ich gesehen habe? Also auf dem Zug gab es, gab es ein Mädchen, die sogar Blümchen auf dem Kopf hatte und sie war sogar Asiaten und oh my god, and she was like just telling this kind of story and then she said she got there and then there were like Americans and they came up to her and they were like, Oh my god, I love your hat. And did you know lilies are my favorite flower? She's like, of course I didn't know that. Like, I didn't know you. <laughs> but anyway, so wild. And now she's gone. She's dead? She's in, no, she just lives in New York. Mm. I'm so sad. I was gonna, I was gonna go there. Thank you. Mm. <clears throat> I'm Dr. Um, yeah. She, I was meant to visit her in March. And then, Kuroot. But it's good that I did. I know someone who got stuck there. Oh, yeah. There's a jazz drummer in Berlin who happened to be there when Corona struck and actually couldn't come back to Europe. Okay, well. Wow. Crazy. Oh, that's really projecting into the store.